Welcome! In front of me I have Xiaomi Redmi Watch 3 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the uh, Mi Fitness application. The icon looks like that. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for your iPhone and the Mi Fitness application to send the notifications to your watch. So first let's open the settings on our iPhone. In settings, find the Bluetooth option and tap on it. Oh, my bad, Bluetooth. In the Bluetooth menu, you should see the list of my devices. On this list, there should be Redmi Watch 3 twice, probably. And once you see both of them, tap on the info icon next to one and look for this page. If you find this page, make sure that the share system notifications option is enabled uh, because the second page for the second Redmi Watch 3 looks like this. So you don't care about this one. You need to find uh, this one, enable the share system notifications option. And once you do, you can uh, go back to the main page of settings, scroll through the page, find the list of applications, and on this list, find the Mi Fitness, tap on it. Here, make sure that the Bluetooth option is enabled. And if you want to, you can also enable the allow notifications option. This one is not uh, required. Okay, let's close the settings on our iPhone. Now, uh, we can open the Mi Fitness application on our iPhone. In the app, you should see the health page. Now tap on the device icon. And on the device page, you should see Redmi Watch 3. Here, scroll down, find the category called notifications and calls, and under it we have app notifications and incoming calls. First, let's tap on app notifications. Here we can enable the notifications for the applications. Basically, if you enable this option, you will see the list of applications right here. And then you can enable and disable the notifications for the specific apps. And how it works is basically, if you enable the notifications, for example, for, mm, I don't know, messages, you will receive the notification from the messages on your iPhone. That notification will be forwarded to your watch. If it's disabled, it will only appear on your iPhone and it, it won't be forwarded to your watch. That's how it works. So enable the notifications for the apps you want. If you don't see the app uh, on the list right here, you can enable the other option. And what this option does is basically, if you enable this option, it enables notifications for every app that is uh, uh, on your iPhone and it's not on this list right here. So basically everything else than this list. Okay, then go back, let's tap on incoming calls and here we can enable the notifications for the calls. So you can enable the option to show the contact info, allow the permission and also um, you can enable the missed calls reminders if you want to. And once you're done, you should be able to receive the notifications on your iPhone, rather on your watch rather, so I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord. As you can see, we got the message on our iPhone and also on our watch. Okay. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video. Thank you.